Hey guys, it's Troy, DIY Home and Auto. Today we're going to talk about uh, maintenance on your air conditioner. And I'm going to give you a tip that could save you thousands. I had a friend who basically ruined their furnace because of the water and the condensation that the air conditioner puts out. It ruined the electronics in their furnace. So if you're leaking water out of anything except for this tube right here, the offshoot tube, see how there's water coming underneath the furnace? I turned the furnace off and it leaked out that side. Oh, gosh. So if you have something similar to that going on, stay tuned. We're going to fix this. Alright, so here's, here's what happens in this case, well, in air conditioner units. Inside, above the furnace, so the furnace blows the air up through, from the furnace up through the duct. And inside of here is your, uh, your coil. Um, you can tell that because here's your air conditioner lines, these go out to your condenser on the outside of the house. But underneath that coil is a tray, um, and it's, oh, an inch and a half or two inches deep. Uh, and it's sealed all the way, and it's, it's there to capture the water. So when you, when you create cold air, it sucks the water out of the air. That water dra drains down into that tray. <clears throat> this is your drain for that, and it's not a high pressure line. You should be able to find a place where it's not glued. Uh, they glued it all the places that are above the furnace because they don't want water getting in the furnace. That's the, that's the whole idea. There was a coupler here that was not glued. So that's where I was able to take it apart. And as soon as I took it apart, you can actually see the water dripping. But look at the floor. It soaked the floor. <laughs> My feet are soaked. I took it out and it literally just gushed out. What that tells me is that this drain from here down is clogged. So I need to clean that out. And pro I, in fact, I think I'm just going to replace it. I'm just going to go get me some pipe and a 90 and replace it so that I know I have good drainage from here down. After I do that, uh, I'm going to let everything dry up real good. Uh, and then I'll give it a test and make sure that it's a solid fix and do an update video here at the end uh, to confirm that what we've done solved the problem. So let's get this thing put back together. While I'm down here I'll replace my uh, filter as well. Of course it's all wet now so that'd be a good idea. Do a follow-up video here in a second to make sure that everything's fixed and will uh, save you thousands of dollars. Do it yourself, right? All right, back from the local hardware store. Um, here's what I picked up. Two two feet pieces of pipe, three quarter inch, three quarter inch 90, and a three quarter inch coupling. They had three quarter inch pipe in 10 foot lengths or two foot length. I don't need 10 feet. I need three and a half feet or something. So. Anyway, what I've got to do is I've got to build that. So I'm just going to take these and cut them, do my thing, duplicate that, take it to the basement, put it on the furnace, the air conditioner, and turn the air conditioner back on so that our house can stay cool. And then let that place dry out and then uh, show you guys that this was the fix for, for the problem that I was having. All right, it might be a little loud in here because I got fans and the air conditioner is running again. But um, the floor is not completely dry, but I'm, I'm confident that we're fixed because 
know if you can see that, but water is actually coming out of the drain now, and it was not coming out before. So everything's dry up here. Everything is looks like it's working. So clean out your drains, people. Your little drain pipe things, and it'll save you a lot of money. Save you some heartache. So um, maybe routine maintenance. Think about doing it now. Change your filter. Clean your downspout. This is Troy DIY Home and Auto. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, hopefully this video helped you and saved you some money. Um, be sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.